You're watching ETN. Share and subscribe. Hi everyone, I'm Amy. You're watching ETN and this is your weekly entertainment wrap up. Starting things off this week is The Flash. It was hinted about at San Diego Comic-Con, but now it's official. Wally West will be joining the cast for season two as a series regular. Now in the comics, Wally is Iris's nephew, but since no other West children have been mentioned on the show, speculation has it that Wally will be another relative or perhaps from an alternate Earth. The Flash season two premieres October 6th on The CW. Continuing in the DC universe, it looks like Batman will be getting another trilogy of films. Warner Brothers was so impressed with Ben Affleck's performance in Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice that they are in the process of extending him an offer for a solo three picture deal. Although this report has not been confirmed, the release dates of the other films that Affleck was scheduled to work on have been pushed back. Is Ben Affleck the definitive Batman? Warner Brothers thinks so, but moviegoers will be the real judge when Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice hits theaters March 25th, 2016. Now on to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Ryan Reynolds premiered the official Red Band Deadpool trailer this week on Conan O'Brien. As you know, I'm a hardcore DC fan, but even I thought this trailer looked great and I can't wait to see the movie. Also, it appears that Deadpool's origins, as seen in the Wolverine film, have been undone. As in the comics, Wade Wilson will have contracted cancer and will be given another chance at life through the Weapon X program. Also, Deadpool's mouth is no longer stitched shut, and he'll be once again the Merc with the Mouth. Deadpool hits theaters on February 12th, 2016. Just when you thought it was safe to fall asleep, Wes Craven's horror classic Nightmare on Elm Street is getting a reboot. Not much is known about the film at this time, but the script is being penned by David Leslie Johnson and developed by New Line Cinemas. Also, the film will once again star Freddy Krueger, but that role has not yet been cast. In other movie news, Sony Film has released its slate of films through 2017. Included in that list are Bad Boys 3 in 2017 and Bad Boys 4 in 2019. It is not known at this time if Will Smith and Martin Lawrence will reprise their roles for the sequels. Also announced was a remake of Jumanji, set for release December 25th, 2016. A sci-fi romance starring Jennifer Lawrence and Chris Pratt called Passengers, set for December 21st, 2016. And the first installment of Stephen King's Dark Tower franchise on January 13th, 2017. That's it for this week's wrap up. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe for daily content. This is Amy for ETN, where we don't do news, we just talk entertainment. Thank you for watching ETN. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. Join the nation's Facebook page to meet other subscribers or visit ETN's Facebook page and Twitter page. Links for all are in the description.